What's up guys? It's the coffin game, and it's only gonna get more messed up. This can't be the right place. We're walking through a nice neighborhood, we have to find our parents' home. Look how nice everything is. No, it's gotta be this, she did sound happy when she talked about their new place too. What's her last name anyway? What do you mean what's their last name? The nameplate's on the doors. Did they go with dad's name or mom's? Dad's, right? Why would they change that at this point? I don't know. To throw us off? Oh god. You really make it sound like they don't want us to find them. I don't want to find them. <laughs> it's only gonna lead to worse things. Just a feeling I got. Hmm. Whatever. Let's find the house of Mr. and Mrs. Graves. Okay. It's gonna be a grave mistake, maybe. Grace really? Grayson? Are we all are we all the Grays here that are starting with the G? Smith? Oh never mind. Smith's okay, it's fine. Ugly than McKitty? Why, why? Come on, man. This is not real. Can you no, no, stop. Jones, okay, cool. Um, what's here? Nothing? Mixed waste and inside? Mixed waste and bio waste. Shocker. Amazing. Thank you, Ashley. Here we go. Ah, oh, crap. Don't just knock. No one comes to open the door. All right, all good. Whatever. Let's find a way in. Okay, probably in the next screen we gotta break in. Or right here, maybe. Let's see. No, we can't go. Okay. Dude, we're so fast. We're zooming. Yep. Aha. Uh -huh. Come on, look at this place. They've got a garden and everything. Doesn't matter. We'll fill our pockets and go. Okay, man, we're criminals. Stealing from our own parents. They've got, like, what? Onions and some carrots. Okay, that's pretty cool. Potatoes. Yeah, okay, sure. We're gonna do this. Carrots and... We can't even interact with those ones. Oh no, a stick! Take it, man! Here grew some scrumptious carrots. Okay. Here grew some tasty onions. <laughs> do the dialogue. Some palat palatable potatoes. Okay, let's just walk in. Back door is locked. Flower pot. Got the key! No! Ah! <sighs> Thank you, game. Dude, I can't handle this. Can I stop? <laughs> this is immediately, man. This is just non... It doesn't stop. One of the planks is loose. Mm-hmm. Okay. Maybe a rock. Heavy rocks? Yeah, well, let's just take it. So we don't have anything. Um... I think this window is... Oh, all right. Okay, I didn't even see that. Can you reach it? Nope. Mm-hmm. Rocks. Okay, maybe the stick now. Maybe the plank. Got wooden plank. Okay, let's see. We gotta build up like a whole thing. Oh, maybe just that easy. It's still too high. Lift me up. Well? No good. It's open but held in place by a latch. My fingers can reach to unhook it. Um, probably now the stick. Yeah, okay. It's one by one. We are solving this conundrum. Ah! Andrew helps you climb through the now open window. I guess we don't need the rocks. Maybe for later. In the toilet or bathroom. Give me your hand. I'll pull you up, man. Thanks, but I'd much rather you just open a door for me. Yeah, yeah, it would be easier. Okay. Can I go back in now? Go back out, actually? Renovations are afoot. Yeah, you just messed it up, man. Look. Or maybe... Did, or, did we do that with the plank? No, I guess that's just how it looks. You turn the handle, but no water. Okay. No water in the toilet bowl. Don't try to use this one. Very, very true. Hmm. Ah, no. Welcome, welcome. Thank you. Not so fast. Huh? Now what do we say? Thank you very much. Wrong. Try again. Uh, exceptionally well done. That was an earth-shattering performance. Yes. To think you would open a door specifically with such grace. It was marvelous, stunning, and breathtaking. Is there a few words that you should describe your ability to trespass? May I come in now, please? <laughs> Got that. You may. Great. Uh, let's split up. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. Uh, hey, there was something I was wondering about. Right now? Can it wait? Our situation is kind of time sensitive. Don't you hear the TikTok? Well, it can, I guess. Good. Tell me later. Hmm. You're just you're just standing there, huh? Watching some, uh, looking at some pictures. Can we leave? You find a letter. Sorry to hear about what happened with the kids. I agree, it was probably a blessing in disguise. Is it the fire, maybe? Don't feel guilty, it's not your fault. For fault. Lord has sorted it out for you. The Lord? 
P.S. Since Andrew won't be finishing college, is there any chance my dog drives textbooks? Okay. Yep. Those are ridiculously expensive. Thanks in advance. Much love to you and your husband. You never told me you dropped out. So again, messed up society. Everyone, no one cares anymore. I didn't. It was just on pause until I got out of quarantine. Given the situation right now, I guess I did drop out. Tough luck for their daughter. Your textbooks are in ashes now. I guess true, maybe they don't know about the fire? Maybe the quarantine was like, to sacrifice them? Maybe they needed money and they sacrificed their children to this weird experiment? Not much in the fridge right now. Kitchen knives, cutting board, blender, this rag, okay sure, a sink, yeah, pot is empty. I mean, we're just looking for like, money, right? Cooking book? Step ladder? Nothing here. Watch some TV? No? Can I talk to... I can go down downstairs. Can go out too. Your parents' trash bins. Or you don't want the trash. Let's just talk. Hey, what are you looking at? Phone your mother never calls you with. <laughs> Strangely sad. Notice how there aren't any photos of us here. So what? Guess I am a little offended. Not like there were any pictures in general in our last place either. True. But now that there are some, why not of us too? Guess we're just too ugly to be put on display. Right, maybe that's it. You're supposed to damn pretty, man! And you're supposed to be robbing the house! Get to it! God damn it. Okay, fine. What are you doing? You're just... You're just in melancholy? A fireplace! They got a goddamn fireplace, Andrew! They got, like, fire magic! Uh... This is some rich people stuff! Who's got a fireplace inside their house? It's not that uncommon, is it? Not in older ones, anyway. Is this house old? I don't know, okay, I mean... Uh, there's some something going on, man. Something happened to us. We're being, like, pushed away. Which, look, we're kind of messed up. So, uh, I don't fully blame the parents, but I kind of do blame the parents. Okay, this is just... Oh, right. Okay, sure, sure, sure. That's how we how that happened. And there's gonna be some goods here. The dresser is locked. We need to find the key. You don't even want to know what your parents have been up to on this bed. You're totally fine with it before, but in this one, no, no. Inside the closet are clothes. And toys and some rope. Well, now we know. <laughs> Close the closet. That's why it's called the closet. The closed. Okay, so we need to find the key to get the goods. The jewelry and the... whatnot. Wait, so what is here? Right, the kitchen. Okay. Looks okay, a bed. Parents have lived here for only a few months, yet they've somehow managed to hoard all this stuff and a spare bed. Money is clearly no longer an issue. The extra bed implies there are no issues in their social life either. And maybe uh, some one of, one of them has to sleep down here if they're kind of like having some trouble. Christmas stuff? Christmas decorations, yeah, yeah, yeah. The key! And some documents. A key, yes, take it! Yes, the dresser key. Metal box of screwdrivers, maybe. This one actually works. Okay, so maybe they live here, down here, until everything is finished up upstairs. Floor drain seems a little clogged. Not your problem. Call them up. Dirty laundry. I the tops it some sexy laundry. How uncomfortable. Cleaning supplies such as vinegar. Washing machine and a tumble dryer. Your parents are living it up. Rubber gloves, hmm. I mean, it's kind of like sarcastic, but again, something is happening with, with, with this family. Uh-oh, where's, where's bro? Where's little bro? Or big bro? Right there. You already know the goods are in here, huh? Our parents seem to have picked up some new and exciting hobbies. Tell me more. Wait, I, I thought you didn't want to. I don't think I will. Now it makes sense why mom kept hassling us to move out. Oh. Can't find the key to the dresser. Man, Andrew, you suck at puzzle games. I got it already. Look at this. Oh, you found the key. Nice. What's in there? No jewelry, but you do spot some paperwork. Uh oh. Um, the cleaning service. Kill, kill, kill our son and daughter. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Graves, you have opted in for comp compensation for damages caused by our company's error. Insurance fraud? No. Our representative will be glad to meet with you. Please come discuss the matter further at your earliest convenience. Flipping through the folder, something else catches your eye. The death certificates of Ashley and Andrew Graves, maybe. Huh? Huh? I did, didn't know we died three months ago. 
the hell is this? Okay, so the parents are evil. It was like set up to 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 kill us. Guess that like something my mom kept telling me not to call. Must have been spooky getting phone calls from a ghost. That's <gasps> somebody has entered the house. <sighs> Isn't this too early? They shouldn't be home yet, man. It's a shame that you wasted all our bullets. <laughs> you just wanna kill them? Like we shoot anyway. Someone there? <laughs> Okay, hi, mom. It's just us. We're the ghosts. Oh, nope. I'm hiding in the closet, man. Nope. Okay. Hello. Oh, you look very uh, unamused. Welcome home. <laughs> Andrew. Okay, the yellow text, of course. Uh, oh, wow. What are you doing here? No hug. No happiness. Just like, God damn it. Surprise. We came for a visit. I see. Hey, you're home so early. To get fired? Okay, wait, this actually, they're kind of putting up the act well. It's my day off, I was just out shopping. How did you two get inside? You left the door unlocked, huh? You should really be more careful about that, Mom. Did I really? Here, let me help you with those groceries. The first theft, we stole in the food. Thanks. You should have let me know you were coming. How about some coffee? Where do you keep the grounds? The top cupboard. What about the quarantine? Any milk in yours? Sure, let me just go wash my face. What the hell are you doing, man? Just play along for now, please. Guess I'll go make some coffee. Uh, can I steal this? Yeah! <laughs> okay, it's nowhere near enough for you. Take more, man. Look. I don't have any gun, <laughs> any mun, any money here, though. I wonder if that's like saved internally somewhere. Okay, f hello. Putting away groceries. Meat wine. Your parents had a night plan. Is the dad gonna come too? Okay. So, uh, this coffee probably. Oh, that's easy, nice. Oh, do music. So, I, I saw the fire. Like, on the news? What What happened? Why you care? What? Oh, God, God. Nah, for him, first we got evacuated. After that, they gave us the go ahead to leave. Since we've been cleared of the parasites. <laughs> Interesting. On the news, they said everybody died. <laughs> that would certainly make that story sell more. Anyway, here we are now. Neither burnt nor full of parasites. I'm, I'm really glad you're safe. My smile is just crazy. Yeah, I sure look like it. <laughs> Quite the upgrade from the previous place, huh? Where'd you get the money for this place? Did you win the lottery or something? Maybe some fraud? <laughs> I wish. This house needs some serious repairs, but the area is so worth it, don't you think? The perfect non-answer. They even hold barbecue events here with the neighbors. My god, you look a little freaky. Ah, barbecue events just like on TV. Just like in the old days before society went downhill. Oh, <laughs> they actually did our cake, mom. Bet you stick out like a sore thumb. You'd be surprised. I'm actually quite well liked. Though it's probably all thanks to my cooking skills. Shame our Ashley didn't inherit any. Hey, what the hell, man? Just made beautiful, perfect, perfect coffee. Ha <laughs> oh, ha! The rest of the conversation is simply dreadfully boring. You do not contribute anything to it. You cannot keep up with Andrew's lies. And if you're being honest, you don't really want to talk to your mom in the first place. Well, it was uh, good seeing you. I see we. Uh, I see where we got the kitty face from. From the mom. Nah, your father should be coming home soon. I really need to start making some dinner. Ah, don't worry about it. I'll make something. You know full well that was her way of telling you to get lost. Oh boy, can't wait to hear how bad it's been. He must have all kinds of stories about repairing this place. That's true. Anyway, why don't you go rest? I'll fix us something. <sighs> why is this happening? I'll take you up on that. Thank you. Mother leaves. Mother has duties to take care of. You are Andrew. Somehow your burglar attempt ended up with you cooking your victim's dinner. Go ahead then, make something you smooth talk, are you? Oh, you're following me, huh? Okay, sure. Some meat? Yeah. O okay. Kitchen, can I just leave? What are you doing, man? Where, 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 where would you be? Maybe you're just chilling here? No, you're probably like in your room. No? I mean, I kind of want to know where you, you went, man. Not outside, really? Ah, hello. Man, don't you two ever get sick of each other? 
Oh, the time, actually. I hear absence makes the heart grow fonder. Well, you don't really seem fond of us. <laughs> the very last thing I need is to grow fonder of that nightmare of a woman. Eh? What are you thinking about me? <laughs> oh no, it's a bullying. Is dinner ready yet? Man, you're the mom! I'm the son! I'm not doing it! Unfair. Here. A purse. Okay, uh, Andrew Andrew is above stealing. Ashley just immediately swipes it. Okay, man. You don't know what to make it. Oh, okay, right. Eh. What? I got this. You can just go do whatever. I don't really care, actually. I'm alright. What is it? It's nothing. You're struck with an odd urge to pull it <laughs> into your arms and force her to stay under the smile. Well, the... But you push such a disgusting idea to the back of your mind. You are above those feelings. Where it may fester with all the other thoughts you wish you never had. Either way, you let her hover over you for now. Oh, cool. You'll need meat, carrots, potatoes, onions. Incredible. Chop everything up and boil in a pot. Meat, carrots... Okay, so it's just everything. Everything that we saw. We're gonna get meat. We're gonna get... Everything from the garden. Maybe we will... Oh, how nice that our parents had all these fresh ingredients. Maybe we will need the rock eventually. While we languished in our apartment, Willie makes one appreciate just how much they love us. Come on, man, we'll get ours. We just have to figure out how to go about this now that she's seen us. Leave no witnesses, Andy. Let's not jump to that just yet. I knew it. Please, just let me think. I'll figure out something, all right? Eh. Get the feeling she has something more to say. But it's gonna start an argument, so you leave it be for now. Hell yeah, man, based. <laughs> Don't care. What are here, man? Rocks, no. Okay, but we got everything. Mom jump scare, no? Nope, okay, sure. Where's the, where's the, there here? Kitchen knives, yeah, we need it. Just curious, uh, did you just use the cultist's cleaver to cut all the ingredients? Yeah, why? <laughs> I, I, it looks pretty cool, I feel cool doing it. I hope you washed it first. I've kept it clean, obviously. Anyway, that should be all the ingredients. Cool? Now just put it in? I don't know, man. I don't like this because it's like, obviously, like, this game always builds up very slowly and then everything goes terrible. That's pretty much how this goes so far. Eh, I still have nothing to say. Alright. Ashley, just, what's, what's up? Spit it out, man. I have something to tell you. But first you have to promise you'll agree. <laughs> I will not promise that, absolutely not. Okay, never mind. Stop being annoying, man, what is it? <sighs> okay, I really wanted you to come to this conclusion by yourself. Yeah, they hate us. But since you won't, let me spell it out for you. They want us dead, we have to kill them before they kill us. Oh, <laughs> no, I will, we have to kill mom and dad. God damn. You just wanna- Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> completely normal reaction, not again. Uh... No, 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 none of that. I actually need their souls to recharge the clairvoyant stream thingy. I am in servitude to Satan Lucifer himself, Andrew. Don't you understand? Do you really? Or are you just gone mad? Eh? <laughs> Interesting that you mentioned this now, of all times. I did try to tell you before, but you just blew me off. And again, I was hoping you'd come around on your own. It's not really that big of a deal to kill them. Shame on me for expecting anything. Let me think. What's there to think about? Ugh. Oh! Man, you look depressed. Hey, kid. Good to see you, I guess. Says that with all the enthusiasm of a dead fish. A dad fish? One extremely tiresome dinner later. Are you... I'm gonna cry. That is the saddest thing I have seen. They're sitting down, freaking Ashley sits on the stepladder. <laughs> I mean, it, maybe it's not super uncomfortable, but it's just like, come on, man. <laughs> that was a riveting conversation. What did we talk about again? I guess that is the blue, because he's definitely feeling very blue. Anyway, sorry kids, I'm exhausted. I'm heading to bed. Could you two clean up? Man. She leaves without waiting for an answer. Music is gone. We know what that means. Here's where you can wash the dishes. Maybe now it's the choice. What if it's the choice? Wait, what did we get? Clear. All right. Be room, room. Can that's like the ending. I guess, yeah, Andy, Andrew has different items than this. I mean, let's just see. You should clean up the ditches like the good mommy's boy that you are. Okay, fine. Yay! 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 
Yep, okay, it's this music. This music is always the, the, the mental drain. We're just going downhill. It can't be done. The dishes, the robbing, or the killing, brother. Robbing nor killing. The more I think about it, the less doable it is, man. It takes one report to the authorities to put us on their radar. I don't really care about that it's our parents, just about the consequences. And if, if, if anything happens to our parents, what do you reckon are the prime suspects? True, surely not their two dead kids, dummy. But were those documents even official? Well, even then, surely the poor grave siblings perish in the fire. Trust me, it only takes one person to start digging into it. And suddenly, we've not only alerted them we're alive, but also revealed our recent whereabouts. We're better off mugging random strangers who have no connection to us. What makes you so sure they won't snitch on us anyway? True. Oh crap, seems to me she already sold us off once before. Assuming she believed me earlier, there would be no reason for her to do anything. She's the kind of person who'd rather stay out of it anyway. I knew it, man, I knew it, I knew it. What? You're all about being so careful. But when push comes to shove, you stick your head in the sand. Hell, well, since you think everything is all good, why not just stay here and play happy family some more? Bet you like that, huh? You seem to get along nice. You know I'm only keeping up appearances, right? I'm actually even crazier than you, and so is she, we're all crazy here. Felt to me it was the same as ever. Ashley, are you kidding me? Eh. Ah, goddammit, you're dumb. Anyway, listen, I chose you, didn't I? I chose you. So if anything one is playing happy family here, it's just you and me. So you were saying you're not happy? <laughs> not that I didn't know that already. Hey man, that's not what I said. If you keep your end of the agreement, everything would just be peachy. I've been behaving. No, you haven't. True. But anyway, it's not what I'm talking about. I agreed to behave and you agreed. It's just us now. Funny, because I remember agreeing to bury Andy and Lele into in their graves. Get it? <laughs> that is funny. I think you're misremembering. I'm not, because it's the only reason I'm here in the first place. I almost killed you, sister. It's just one episode ago. Then you must have misunderstood me. What? If you don't like it, why don't you stay here with mommy and daddy and be a good little murder boy? Why don't you leave me to rot? Clearly you don't even like me. You're the one who doesn't like me. It's all about Andy with you. Oh, well, guess what? Andy is dead. Me, me, me. Yeah, you're going villain mode. You're right. I really don't like this, Andrew. I'm sorry to hear that. Because Andrew is all you'll get, Missy. No, now isn't the time for this anyway, goddammit. Let's just leave. Let's figure out what we'll do about the money, and the trinket. <gasps> Maybe I'm gonna sacrifice you, brother. <laughs> I don't know what that is, if we're leaving anyway. With, with the trinket charged, we at least have the means to stay safe. <gasps> Uh-oh. Bro, you're right there. It's a really bad situation. I get that. But if we leave quietly, well, there'd be no need for anyone to look for us. Andrew, I don't believe for a second that woman can keep her mouth shut without being dead. <sighs> Ahem. Why are you two whispering about killing me or something? Nothing. Uh, you need something? Just like peas in a pod. Eh? I don't suppose you've gotten any friends you could go stay with, please? Oh. There isn't enough space in this house, you know? There's a spare bed, but... Uh, despite it being fine. That's one. And you're both already in your 20s. I don't know how else to say it. No, no, it's... Yeah, we're not planning on living here. Thanks for the invitation, though, Mom. It's not like you're unwelcome to visit. There's just no room to keep housing you indefinitely, you know? Yeah, yeah, I get it. And since you're already here, I guess one night won't be a problem. But you need to start looking for somewhere else to stay first thing in the morning. <gasps> and it should probably be two separate places, huh? Uh, yeah. That's a tall order after our, all our earthly possessions just burned to the ground. It's amazing what money can buy once you got a job, goddammit! Speaking of which, I got morning shift tomorrow. There's a spare bed in the basement. Andrew, you can take the couch. Ah, fine, good night. Good night. Love you. Well, are you going to bed? I'm not that tired, I'm just staying up. Ooh. I don't know. It's it's like she's not even care. Like there's just this this lack of care of like everyone who lives in this world. It's crazy, man. You're under my roof right now. You will go to your designated sleeping areas this instant. Uh, sleep now or get out at once. <laughs> Jesus, 
You pretend to go to bed until your parents fall asleep. There's no way we're doing this. Going to sleep is the worst. During the day, all the noise, Ashley, it all keeps your mind occupied. But at night, alone with your thoughts, there's nothing to distract you from yourself. Despite every, having every attention of going to pick a fight with Ashley, you drift off to sleep. Oh, really? We dead. We crazy. It's an, it's an Andrew dream. Maybe we're gonna see the demon? I don't know if we have a soul, a an evil soul. I'm just gonna save, just, you never know. Oh, dude, the, is that the first Andrew save? That's crazy, man. It's the music. Fridge or the freezer? Ooh, cultist greetings, neighbor! Hath thou arrived to borrow sweet granules of sugar? Beholdest thou my witness, not but flesh doth I possess to present unto thee. Uh, all ghosts are apparently required to speak like this. Yeah, even the recently passed ones. Oh, right, it's the cultist! I didn't even see you. Oh, you read too much. You read too much poetry. Be alert, young Mr. Graves. It's time for you to compartmentalize. Cool. What ails thee, my friend? Okay, can I go with... Well, is, is, is there our sins crawling up our back? The blood of our victims? The freezer is not full of human meat. There's a severe lack of human meat. I see, so we have to... Uh, quick, 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 quick. We have to get the human meat. Got a limb. Got a limb. Got a nothing. Pan is empty. Right, Ashley already cooked one. Whoa. Um, I wanna go back? Okay. So now we're like in um, complete crazy time. You know, this is like crazy mode. This is just psycho. Hours. It's missing candles. Who are you? Are you who I think? Oh! Thank god, man. This is actually kind of weird. Are you who I think it is? Or someone else? What are you doing here? Oh, it's little Laylee. Never mind. Okay. I <laughs> no, don't answer. Just I don't care. Just go away. Get lost, man. You're not supposed to exist. What are you doing here? Says who? You? You're not the boss of me, Andy. Forget this. No! Get out of here! God damn it! Stop following me! <laughs> what the hell? Wait, I have to save. Oh no! There's actually in our party the worst ending. Leave, man! We got an annoying little thing. Do you have candles, maybe? Let me get that. Oh, thank you, Laylee. Nothing happens. You're welcome. You used your lighter to light the candle. Oh, this is weird. Sure is dark that way. Good thing I got these candles. Hand them over. No way! Dude, look. It's not gonna work. I have to, though. Is the, is, is, this is the game ask? Is this a dream? This would be the funniest thing. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I apologize. Ask nice. I have... I, I, it's not gonna do it, but come on. Kill her, man. I, I'm scared, but... Oh, you reach to grab Laylee by her stupid little neck to give it a good ring, just like before, with the real sister. Ah, 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 what the hell? Oh, she evades you, of course. Well, what was that, you psycho jerk? Whatever, it's just a dream anyway. I can finally do what I've been wanting to do. Most people will still be horrified to kill a child. You're not really a child, man. You're more like a demon. I guess you're used to it, huh? Yeah, well, in most people's lucid dreams, they can fly and whatnot. I'm stuck with crap like this. Serves you right, man. Okay. Okay, fine. <laughs> we got a little gremlin behind us. Hello? Um, can you jump it? Ah, of course. It's a maze. Oh my god, man. God damn it. Can you... Yeah, hello? No? Thank you. Uh-huh. Okay, let's watch TV first. White noise. But this is more like black space. Even in your dreams, the entertainment sucks. What do you want to play today? Nothing. To go to bed, man. Boring. I don't care. Just go to sleep. Never wake up again. I don't want to sleep. I want to draw. Draw then, man. Just don't leave this spot, you baby. I can't draw without my pencils. <sighs> well, if I nick myself, I can get rid. Ooh. Ah, I'll get your pencils. Thanks, Andy. You're the best. Oh, but no, you're just in bed. So that's just good night. You've reduced yourself to an errand boy for a Laylee that doesn't even exist. Way to go, loser. <gasps> who are you? And who's the demon? 
Wait, there's a person and a person that we don't know. And the music is crazy, man. Hello. We can't even go here. I mean... Hmm... Nothing to light. I mean... Okay, okay. Is this what- that, that's- is that Ashley? Someone stares inside the room with an unblinking gaze. Trashes full of letters, death threats, oof. A collection of photos and notes your girlfriend cherishes. I see ya. Or your ex-girlfriend, okay. So this is kind of like the scene. This is our girlfriend, and she's evil. Cause- cause Ashley, we remember, she ruined it for us. Colored pencils, okay. Your ex-lover's dormitory room. 127 new voicemails. Hell no, okay. Oh, I don't know what your problem is. Audio has been distorted, but you'd recognize that voice anywhere. Yep, Ashley, I warned you. You think you're all that? You think something special? Just under whole? <laughs> Even the only one. Got a slew just like you. I enjoy what you have because you want to. Yeah, yeah, no, no. Okay, if there's actually like a hundred, I'm not gonna go through all of them, but yeah, he feels sorry for you. Um, yeah. Okay, I, okay, like that's good. Ashley! But you'd. You'd be so super. Ashley! Stop it! Stop it! You. Do you think you're better than me? Dude, absolutely crazy. I can't? <laughs> Excuse me? You think this life is delusional? I never love you. I don't care. He loves me. I'm the only one. I'm everything. I'm a secret you'll never hear. Why are you talking like some eldritch horror, man? When you need someone to hold on to, it's not you. He's excited. It's me. That's enough of that. Look at the demon, man. Hello. What do you hope to find in their pervert? Well, hello. Julia. You've been quiet all day, what's up? No oh, man, no, it's, it's nothing. Or actually, I've been thinking about something a lot lately. I don't know if I should bring it up. With that much build-up, you kind of have to now. Eh, well, okay, but please don't get mad. When have I ever once even raised my voice with her? You know you can tell me anything. I talked to my sister about where you sit the other day, and she agrees with me that Maybe it's, like, maybe it'd be better for Ashley to learn some independence. Even just for her own sake, you know? Hmm. And maybe for our sake, too? I think it'd just be nice if you could stay over more often. Not, like, always cut things short or cancel on me so much. Sorry. I'm not reprimanding you. I can't make her learn anything, though. No, but you could, like, just not always go when she asks. If your sister needed something, wouldn't you go? Well, yes, but she only asks if she actually needs something. I suppose. Sorry, may maybe I shouldn't have said that. Or brought this up after all. Nah, it's fine. Guess I'm still shook up over what happened to your friend way back when. Dude, not even- Dude, the liar. The lying little Andrew, huh? Ashley might not look like it, but I think it affected her a lot too. And you're smiling after saying that with Andrew, you're a psycho! That's probably why she is how she is. I really don't get that impression at all. For someone so obnoxious, she's surprisingly difficult to read. Isn't she? No, 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 she's different generally. Sorry, I didn't catch that? Eh, <laughs> nothing, go on. Anyway, I worry still about something uh, like that happening to her. Or happening to you. <gasps> I can't let either of you out of my sight. Well, this is sad. <laughs> I'll be fine if you're with me. Would you tie your hair up for me? Heck no, you'll pull on it again! <laughs> oh, but don't you know it's how boys show their love? Now that's just awful, hee <laughs> I suppose she still lingers. Mm-hmm. Hasn't been that long. Just kind of forgot about her with all the chaos going on. We'll never see her again. And the fact it doesn't really bother you bothers you. I mean, you've got a you got a whole messed up life, man. I'm sorry to say. And of course, this is our mind, huh? It's torn between this one and a little demon gremlin. Hello. Yeah, yeah. What should I draw? I wouldn't want to hinder your artistic genius with my bad ideas. Good call. Whatever. As a thank you, I shall give you a candle. Treat it carefully, as if it were me. <laughs> I'm lighting it on fire, bozo. 
Not cool. That's flames for ya. <laughs> Got a candle. Okay, what you doing, man? Focus on drawing. Look, I'm gonna ruin it, man. Fine, bye. You still here, huh? You you monster watching from the shadows. Placed and lit the final candle. Yeah? Is that... Oh no, that's the wardens, okay. Yep. And that's the... Okay, that's... that's we're, we're caged. Look, look, we're caged. We feel like we're caged. We were forced to kill. Ashley would have wanted to kill this one anyway. You couldn't leave any witnesses after all. Still, you can't comprehend why there hasn't been even a mention of her on the news. Because this world is screwed up. Surely someone found her before the fire burned the apartment down. There's no investigation, there's no police, there's nothing. It doesn't bother you. Uh, well, that's not good, Andrew. Mister. You killed this one to protect Ashley. No regrets. Back when he and his buddies still fed you, this one was always leering at her. Never mind, there is one regret. You wish you could have killed him slower. I mean, look, the wardens are kind of scum. I guess. Because they, they, they seemingly fully were aware of what was happening. This one you had to get before he got you. It worries you someone wanted you dead badly enough. Ah, that's the... Never mind, that's the, that's the assassin. Badly enough to hire this guy. It's just the government, right? Or like the, 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 the parents? Cleanup service? Something like that. Who's in here? Found Ashley in the closet. Yep, okay, thanks for watching. This is where we end the game. <laughs> this is where it uninstall. Is this the most horrifying? line I could have ever imagined. I don't want to continue. Oh, there you are, you menace. Ha <laughs> ha I'm missing that limb you cooked. Andrew, you need to wake up. You are mm, losing it. I figured you'd have it. It's in your stomach, right? And mine. You gotta cut us up and get it back. Yep. I'd rather not. What well, you need it for anyway. There's plenty of limbs right behind you. That's true. Are you coming out of there? You're supposed to ask Lily to come out and play. I'm asking for Ashley. I'm not coming. So yourself. Alright, are we gonna- are we really, really gonna- Oh, do I have to choose? I don't know. This one doesn't work. Warden or- I don't know, man. This is definitely more guilt. Is this bad or good? I would go for the one who's more guilty that we killed her. Just, just, me, me, but maybe that makes Andrew go even crazier. <sighs> God damn it. I don't know if that really matters. Well met, young Graves. Oh, bye. <laughs> I'm out of here. What about here? Oh, place a limb in the freeze. Right, right, right. I guess that's all we have to do, huh? The, the possesseth the absent limb. It just does not belong to me. Perchance, tis of little consequence to thee. Your voice, your, 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 your manner of speaking has gone even more intense. Cool. Oh, wait. I could get the other limb, though. Oh my god, the noises. Got a limb. Dost thou reckon that my mortal frame was consumed by the flames? Forsooth I do not. Methinks the innards of a freezer doth not combust. Perchance it may cook, but to burn I knoweth not. Verily, the most foolish deed thou hast ever committed was to leave mine own remains in thine own dwelling. Praise the heavens that some souls sought to protect themselves, kindled a flame which engulfed all. Thank you. <laughs> it's very... Can go here. You don't want to talk anymore? Cool, man. I'm putting this right here, okay? This reminds you of something. Yeah, we're opening it up. E no, you don't wanna. Really. E oh, now the guilt's coming, finally. You have to, man. You have to uh, accept the past. No, uh, don't show me. If they show, it's too much. I'm scared. Rise and shine. Nina, now we know the name. <laughs> Did you have fun? Did you have a fun night? Sure hope you learned your little lesson. There's no answer. I guess she's still sleeping. Dude, I don't, I don't really don't wanna, I don't wanna open it. I don't, I don't, game, don't. I mean, it's not a skeleton, cause it's been like a day, but it, that's even, I don't know. I <sighs> Lily kicks the crate, come on, man. Wake up, sleepyhead. Come on, don't. You open the crate. 
I, I know this. You gently open the crate. Yep. Yep. Psycho. Psycho. Absolute psycho. I was giving her the benefit of the doubt. After everything, I was giving her the benefit of the doubt. I was like, this is, this is the moment where she went crazy. This is the moment where she killed someone and from there it just went downhill and she never recovered. She was born evil. That's why she has the tar soul. She's, she's a demon. This is confirmed. She w look at this. No child can react this way if they're not a demon. Andrew has some hope, even though I think that hope is kind of losing. She's evil. That's insane. <laughs> wow, she's dead. Wow. Well, that can be right. What's going on here? Whatever. If you're so weak that you die like that, clearly nature doesn't want you to live. Shut up. Just shut up. Forget this. Let's leave her here. No one's gonna find her. Since you took the stick off, it looks like she went there on her own anyway. No, it doesn't. Why would she have clawed at the crate until her fingernails split? Don't. Oh well. It's not like anyone knows she's here. Let's leave her. No, she'll... They'll start rotting. And someone will come looking and find her. Her family was already looking for her. It's only a matter of time until they come check her here. What do we do then? Ah, uh, uh, let's just hide it then. <laughs> if no one knows, then it's not a problem. They're gonna know Laylee. They'll find the body and they'll know. And then they'll throw me in prison for the rest of my life. Me too. It's fine if it's the both of us. No, you idiot! You don't get it, do you? Guys and girls don't go to the same prison. Oh, uh, they're going to take you away from me. Never mind, man. Yeah, look, crazy. Crazy time. How was I supposed to know that? You figure something out then. You're so smart. Okay, let's just, like, move her somewhere. A grave. Let's dig up a grave for her. That's how we get... <laughs> I don't know. That's how we get the last name. Alright, where? Anywhere in the forest should be fine. There's a park right outside. It's probably fine. First, we need to wrap her up in something. No one can see us carry her there. Uh, don't, don't, oh no, I regret it. Don't give me the drawing. Oh no, okay. Instant regret. Okay, we're leaving. We need to find something, huh? Just a trash bag. Oh no, never mind. Or maybe the tarp, okay. You wrap the corpse inside the tarp and carry her away. Couldn't find the shovel, but I figured these planks work too. They're kind of shovely. Just watch for splinters, brother. Splinters are the least of my worries right now. Let's pick a good, easy dig spot. Got a wooden plank. Okay. Right here, I guess. Can we talk? Or, <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Rabbit's at the top. Okay. Maybe here. There's no roots in the way. I'm tired. Yeah, this is way harder than I thought it would be. Isn't it deep enough? A grave should be six feet, right? Forget it. She fits here just fine. Fine, okay. Just push it in. Yep. Aye. This is messed up, man. And now back. Dum dum, yep. And... <laughs> it doesn't look natural at all, true. Put like... I don't know. Looks fine to me. There can't be this... It's the obvious of a spot needs to be hidden. When I hide it with some leaves and such. Okay. That's the... Yeah, okay. I mean, that's it, maybe? Okay, sure. We can't leave or anything. Maybe some rocks? No. Just, all right, just boom. boom. Some more foliage. Okay. Really? This one, I guess? No? Oh. Um, oh, my, I hear... Nice. There we go. Yeah, this looks much better, huh? This is all getting blown away by the next breeze. There's gotta be something in here to hold them in place. The rock. Or the multiple rocks. No, just one? Okay. Nice. Makes me wanna write our name on it. Out of the question. I wasn't gonna do it, I was just making a joke, man. <sighs> what is it now? She's hidden. What if they find her? What if a police dog digs her up? Listen, forget it. I can't. Of course you can. What was that smile? Did you know if you don't think about something for a real long time? It never happened, brother. Because you can't remember it no more. Uh, 
Let's forget all about it together. But lately, I need to know you won't say anything to anybody. Promise me this stays between us. I mean, eventually they found out that she's dead, right? Because we saw the memory, the dream. But maybe it was just gone missing, but surely they find that. I just said we'll forget all about it. You say one thing, then you do another. Promise me that this time you'll be honest. You'll honest to God. Keep your goddamn mouth shut. I promise. I won't say anything. I'll never even say her name again. What was it anyway? I don't remember it anymore. And that's why we don't even... That way it was the four-letter name. We don't even remember. <sighs> there, there. It'll be fine. Insane. Insane. Bro, Andrew, you gotta, like, do something. It's <laughs> Just kidding. I'm gonna tell on you. If you won't do what I say, I'll tell everyone all about what you did. Who's gonna play with you if I'm in jail? I'll send you letters. I can't read your crappy handwriting. Guess you'll just have to do all I say then. Otherwise, you'll be all alone in prison. Eh. I am your best friend from now on. You already were, Laylee. Don't lie to me. I'm not. I, I think. Whatever. It's you and me now. No one else will like you. Because you're bad. You're a bad person, Andy. But I won't tell anyone. Of course not, you'd be in trouble too. So what? No one likes me anyway. But that's fine, because you'll be around now. God, you stupid girl. I've been here this whole time. None of this needed to happen. You could've just... I know you don't like me. Uh, Andy, I know. But, <laughs> dude, how do you go from tearing up to this gremlin face? You're insane. Now on, from now on, no one will like you either. Let's be friends forever, okay? Eh, be my friend or else I'll kill you. <sighs> I'll be whatever you want me to be. <laughs> really? Woohoo! From now on, let's always be together. You had a million things you wanted to say to this creature, none of which were pleasant. But absolutely nothing came out of your mouth. Several days went by without a hitch. Ooh, still in the past. Uh-oh. Can I eat your ice cream? Oh, dude, they're in the old apartment. So they were there for, like, the whole life almost. Okay. Go for it. Uh, really? I can't seem to eat anything lately. Nom nom nom, you have to put the jam in your strawberry ice cream. That's gross, man. I wish there was no jam. You wish you had any capacity to care at all. Anyone asked you about those, you know, things? Yeah. Teacher asked everyone in class. Even officers came by, too. Did you say anything? Nope. I only asked Julia if she was expecting to see anyone the other day. Julia, right. So, Ju well, I mean, Julia's the, the girlfriend? The, the future one, but not yet. In the future, and Nina is the dead one, is that right? Why? Because a certain someone told her mom she went to study with Julia. So I thought maybe she told Julia she was gonna come to see, see you instead. Did she? Dunno. Because I didn't want to just come out and ask. But Julia said she was visiting family that day. I doubt she had any idea. It promises me nothing. Huh? Why are you being cold to me? You're worse than you were before, man! I gave you my ice cream. <laughs> come on. Do it. Stop. I see how it is. You're pining for oh uh, Here we go again, man. She's dead. You're still all about her, aren't you? Uh, it's never good enough with her. What a snake. I bet she died on purpose. I need a goddamn knife. <laughs> Where are you going? Here. Rude. Oh, okay, man. How, how long is this sequence, man? This is just complete Andrew time. I'm sorry, pal. Where's the knives? Why? Got a kitchen knife. I mean... No need to leave the house. We probably can't go. I mean, maybe. Someone is being interviewed. Your success story is such an inspiration to us all. Before starting your soda company, you used to be a surgeon, huh? That's right, Mark. I'm, I'm actually a doctor. But one can of toxic soda a day keeps me far, far away. <laughs> when even a doctor tells me to indulge, well, how can I not? <laughs> Surely it's only up from here. So what's your plans? Uh, well, with such a great demand comes a great need for water. Which is why I've partnered up with several water distribution companies to replace the water with my soda. Yeah, this is the start of a long-lasting friendship where... I ramble on and on. 
and no dead girls being found in this society they wouldn't they probably wouldn't even have that happen hey dad hello son hi dad uh. <sighs> Me, me, oh, that's happy family. Bye, dad. Oh, no, no, I'm not jumping. Uh, huh? R right, it's just a job. Oh, fired, huh? Yikes. Your mother said I was too good for that one anyway. Wait, you got fired, dad? Life goes on, I guess. Precious life. We're all important, Anders. It's Andrew, actually. <sighs> I, I went with the wrong name when you were born. I'm sorry, son. I'll go see what they've got for me at the unemployment office. Great talk, son. Keep it up. I hope you're winning. Okay, thanks, Dad. Maybe we can find the mom. But do I want to? I don't know at this point. Hmm, okay. Are you dead? No, we gotta finish the job. What, what are you doing with that knife, brother? Briefly. You wonder if killing her would be worth it. Perhaps solve all of your problems in the future. I'm going to make a blood oath with you. You are the demon, Andy? You summoned the demon with a blood ritual? In return, you'll have to promise me something too. Okay. Keep my secret. I'll keep you company. And what if I don't? Well, I guess. Heh, <laughs> you're all bark. Nah, man, you're all bark. We know Andrew is all bite. He's crazy. You wouldn't do anything. If you'll ruin my life anyway, why keep up appearances? Moreover, I am doing this for you. Then what happens if you break the promise? I won't if you won't. Not buying that. Do it. We need the whole... We need, we need like, an episode one. We need the scene where Andrew just freaking holds the knife to the throat. I'm sorry, but the drama is, like, the best part of the game. <laughs> Lately, you are a miserable, loathsome creature that has somehow wormed its miserable way into every aspect of my equally as miserable life. And for that, my heart will always have a rotten, moldy, sore spot just for someone like you. Make of that what you will. I mean, I'll take it by sheesh, man. Whoa! Gently! <laughs> okay. Me? How does one cut someone gently, huh? A better man would know. Whatever. <laughs> oh. Ah, the ex, huh? She forever keeps her mouth shut. <gasps> Only as long as you keep your eyes closed. This is kind of weird, man. This is not normal behavior for anybody in the world. Let no one steal your gaze. It's just us now. Ah, uh, I said, where's the blood? The blood's gone. I said, I said I'd be around. I never said there wouldn't be others. Wait, wait, no, I want to do over. Too late. Promise is a promise, idiot. Andy, that's no fair. Don't be like that. I'll make you a priority, just not the only. It's not enough. Why can't you just? She's crazy. She's mental. She's unstable. She needs to be destroyed. She's not normal. This is not a normal child. This is not a normal child. You were like eight years old or something. Kill our parents, no? <laughs> Wait, that's not what you said back then. Oh, do it for your cute little sister. I know you want to. Ashley is a demon. She's invading your dream. And she's changing the past. She's twisting the memories to make you kill your parents. Kill them all. Kill them to feel so... <laughs> Excuse me, hello. <laughs> are, we, are we waking up? Are you doing this to us right now? Kill them for food, Andrew. Kill them to avoid the things I'll do to you if you don't. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, Andrew's not falling for it. Nice one. Ah, look who's awake. Good morning. Oh, or night. It's still nighttime, actually. We gotta kill them real quick, bro. What she want, you little creepy? Creepo? I don't know. Offer mom and dad to the demon, goddammit. Right now? Right now. They're asleep. We'll set the ritual up real quick all and just do it, man. It's gonna be real funny. Uh, I've given you plenty enough time to figure this one out, yet you just haven't. Now we're doing it my way. Meh. Yeah, for sure. What? Oh, wow. Huh, that was easy. <laughs> Welcome back, Andy. Bro, punch her. Punch her right now. That's not it. But you have a point that mom might snitch on us. I knew that even before we got out of the apartment. Don't know why I let myself think anything else after talking to her. 
It's because at your core, you're just a soft, gooey marshmallow. If it weren't for me, all kinds of vile women would have gobbled you up. Jump! Whoop. Ah, uh, what are you doing? A demonstration. <laughs> God, you're so dumb, I should kill you. Oh. Andrew? Oh, well, that's gonna be unfortunate. You're still awake? Yeah. Hey, why well, I still up? I thought you had work tomorrow. I wanted to talk to you without that Ashley person. Just sitting on the door floor. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> okay, that's kind of dumb. It's not really a good time right now. Look, I know it's late. This is important, man. I think she's a demon. I've been thinking things over and I believe I owe you an explanation. Uh, look, I don't really need to know. I'm really tired. <sighs> don't come in here, man. Andrew, I understand you're angry, but at least listen. The whole situation with Ashley was... Oh. Eh, go on, ma'am. Don't mind little old me just sitting on the floor. <sighs> yeah, yeah, it's, uh... For the love of God, this had better not be what it looks like, you two. Oh! Brother, she is crazy! What is this? You can't even put this in the game! What is this psychopath? This is... Why, how does this look to you? <laughs> this is just straight up. I mean, good thing. I mean, she doesn't know it's not like. I can't imagine this happening to you, man. Ah, uh, why the hell you get. <laughs> What's it looking like now, mom? Dude, good ending. Good ending because she can't kill the mom, maybe? Ashley, wait, come on, man. You know there aren't any bullets left in that gun. But your mom sure don't. Whoa, Ashley, put that away. There's no need for this. Be quiet. Start walking. We're going to the basement. Don't get any funny ideas, because I will shoot. Andrew, go get her rope. I'm tying her up. And don't kill Dad. Yeah, you don't need to be told that. Bro, can I just... I mean, I know where we get the rope from. Hello. Don't move, don't scream. I will shoot. Why are you doing this? Don't talk. Shut up and wait. Whoop. Mm hmm. Andrew, we're, we're hello. Can I here? I'm 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 hiding. Why are you uh, not hiding? Blocking the shot. Did you find anything that you're up with it? You know how are you doing? Andrew. Just checking. Mm -hmm. Andrew. Why well, I'm still looking for something? Look elsewhere. Don't talk to her. Don't even look. Even the mo Ashley man. I can't trust you not to get all misty eyed. Ashley. Marshmallow spine. Oh! <laughs> the snake! <laughs> the snake sound effect. Beloved, don't test me. Okay, sorry, man. Whatever trust she had in you was quickly eroding. Good! <laughs> Hurry up and find some rope, goddammit. Oh, we have to fight against the demons, man. Holy moly. Okay, sneak in and don't kill dad. How you doing, man? Quite the heavy sleeper. Okay, we know it's here. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, Noah. He's gonna wake up. <gasps> Don't! Quiet, man. He woke up. Nice one, Butterfingers. Son? What on earth are you doing? Uh, sorry, I needed some uh, rope. Yeah. Yeah. I wanna tie mama. Yeah. Beautiful! Is incredible! And because the stat is so depressed and s sleepy, probably, he's gonna be like, yeah, I get that, have fun. <laughs> oh, never mind, where's your mother? Oh, no, okay, never mind, we're getting... Things are gonna go bad. <laughs> Andrew, man, I don't know what's happening. Uh, in the basement. Uh, but... What the hell, man, she could use some help. I guess we're just gonna getting, get both down there. Your father goes to check up on your mom. Yeah. Maybe you should... Yeah, well... Everything's going to crap. Honestly, at this point, you know what you do? Honey, is everything alright? You take out your... No! No! Stop it! I, I'm... No! This is not normal! This is not normal! We're leaving. We're, li we're leaving. We can leave. Can I eat some carrots? We... I can't do this, man. This is insane. This is crazy. Can I get some purse, no? Just run, just run away, man. Run away from your problems. Imagine, good ending. <laughs> nope, okay. <sighs> I tried. You can't say that I didn't try. You can't say I didn't try. 
Oh my god, man, I'm gonna see. Where's the dad? Oh, right there. What's going on? Are we- But Ashley said don't kill dad. Don't do it, man. Okay, okay. Oh, no, look at the dad, man. Weren't you supposed to- <laughs> Dad is not a normal- What is wrong? No, I feel kind of bad, man. The dad looks cool. No, man, I'm- No, I don't know. Stop it, man. Just walk down, goddammit. Slow and steady. You tie your father up with the rope. Some old rope burns on his wrist. Hmm. Rope. That sucks. It just sucks. Hey. Hurry up and find some rope. I oh, another one, huh? Okay. I don't know. Do we remember where rope is? Christmas lights! Okay, thank you, of course. Okay, that here be screwdrivers. Okay, okay, okay. And I will tie you up. Yeah, yeah. This is what your life has come to. Good. Now, you remember how to perform the ritual? Hold up. Mom, what's the pin for your credit card? Wow. Is that what this is all about? Money? You go this far just for a quick buck. What's the pin? Where's the card? In my purse. Yep. You just believe her? Okay, gonna try this now. You stay here, don't do anything. That depends on them. If she gave me the wrong pin and you end them, then what? Again, depends if they behave. <sighs> right. I'll be quick. Hey, hey parents. Hey, how are you doing? Someone has to keep an eye on these two. I don't think they're going anywhere, man. Got a credit card. Oh, wow, what are you doing here, man? Get back downstairs. They're not gonna try anything. Only takes one of them to start screaming for this whole thing to blow up in our faces. It is amazing how cooperative a person is with a gun pointed at them. Yeah, go point. I'll be right back. It's just... Eh, out with it, man. I need to get going. You're with me on this, right? Sacrificing them to Satan? Didn't I already say so? Well, you have this habit of, like, flip-flopping? Ah, oh, god damn it. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> Look, trust me, Ashley. We're doing this. <sighs> the best come back soon uh, yeah see you in a bit no i hate this i actually hate this picking up the money you decide to set the ritual okay is he mu music runes and a book blood candles and cannibalism yes well no runes candles and blood it's music yeah yeah I hope that wasn't too important. True, we don't have that. Runes on the floor in the book? The book was just the instructions. Eh. Whatever, I can start with the runes. Need some blood to draw with. I, I am really uncomfortable with whatever is gonna happen here. Like, this is torture. This is just messed up beyond belief. To you, human shape. Human shaped sacks of blood. I'm sorry, man. You need a knife? I guess we're gonna get that from the kitchen. I'm um, here? Yep. <laughs> yeah, this is totally normal. Totally normal game that we're playing here. Absolutely nothing wrong. Alright, here's what's gonna happen, you two. I'm gonna cut one of y'all to draw some blood. If you scream, I'll blow through your, over your brains out. How about that? Just take the money and go. What do you need our blood for? And now you care what I'm about? Don't you act like I haven't tried with you, Ashley. Yeah. You're the one who shut me out. But even then, I've stuck my neck out for you all this time. Like the time when you left me to starve for three months, tried to get me killed. Was that you looking out for me, Aji? Thanks! You know goddamn well what I'm talking about. I never told anyone what you two little psychos did to that girl. <laughs> what you on about? Take your meds, mom. I know you and Andrew did something to that classmate of yours who went missing. I knew it the second she was found dead, near that warehouse you used to play at. Whatever. If I didn't love you, I could have rid myself of you right then and there. When it comes to being a mother, I am a saint, Ashley. A saint. Ah, the patron saint of recovery one. Yeah. You have any idea what they would have done to you if they found out? Now then, you paragons of virtue. Let's see whose blood I should use. If you make me choose, I'm gonna be mad. Bro, stop! Stop! I don't... This sucks, man. Look. The mom is kind of messed up and evil, but justified, like, in, like she's kind of right. 
but she is being aggressive. The father literally did nothing and is doing nothing. But... But the mom has been... I... 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 Ba, ba, ba. No, it shouldn't be random. At this point, I, I, I'm gonna go with the mother. It's gonna be more drama. Dude, don't... Okay. Honey. It's fine to worry about me. Yeah, she wouldn't worry about you in return. Nah. Okay, see? She, she's kind of she's kind of tough. The father might have... I don't know. She's, she's crazy. She's just, just like Ashley. Let's see here. Yeah, something like that. Now let's finish. Do I really have to? Over? Around? How are you doing, you two? Nothing. Y yeah? All right, here. Look, him, I do a circle. You even know what a circle is? It's not that true. <laughs> okay, you're really dumb, man. I'm sorry. The nerve of you. Never. No. Don't matter. Get a rise out of you now. Candles, candles, candles. I right here, right? Yeah! Times four! And we remember it's here, here, here. Man, this game's messed up, huh? Why are we doing this? It's all the candles. Oh! Welcome back! Uh, you don't care, huh? Andrew, give us a hug! You had a draw limit on your card! Oh. I do? You do! Could only get a couple of hundred before it locked me out! So Brother! This is- I know this is a bad situation! Look! This could be either best mom or worst mom. In in a normal situation, a mom like this could be kind of funny. In this situation, I feel like they're all out to just kill each other. But I guess at this point, it doesn't matter. Yep, <laughs> being insufferable runs in this family. Well, now we all get to witness the wonders of customer service. Really? Get up, you have a call to make. Tigger, what's happening? You try your gun. Hello. Off we go. I got the freaking mom in my party. You owe me a hug. What's with you tonight? I thought you grew out of this touchy-feely crap. There's just a lot going on. If you need one, sure. You know, with the audience. <laughs> Never mind, you're just fine. Forget it. Get to it, man. Da, 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 da. And then police is at the front door. Nope. In luck. Okay, open just for the day. I see, it's very nice. It's already a million hour wait. Guess what? You wait. Yep. Yep, this is the right music to play. Hey, please hold. Uh, oh, is that the music they play? Yeah. Well, this is awkward. Please hold. Yeah. 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 Please hold. Yep. Quarter millennia later. Oh, finally. I'm sorry. Let me just confirm. You said you want me to remove the draw limit altogether. That is what I said, yeah. Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> what if your card gets stolen or something? Wouldn't that be wacky? Indeed. I'm not at all being held at gunpoint here. <laughs> wow, that's a, that's a good joke right there, Mrs. Wow. Oh, there you go, man, you're gold. Have a nice day. Anything else I can help you with? Uh, no, definitely not. Alrighty then, have a nice day, Mrs. Graves. <laughs> Uh, back into the basement with you, bozo. Don't think for a second. I didn't see the stunt you were trying to pull there. Which is small talk. Up. Oh. This is. Hey, what about your purse? You remember that? You happy? <laughs> Don't. I was so ready to, because I was. I'm traumatized by the game now. Every time you go down there. Andrew may have killed some- Please don't tell me the father is dead. Maybe the blood is being hidden. Why do we need rubber gloves? I don't like that. Hello. The car should be freed now. Unlike your mother, who okay, take that back up. I was looking at what you've set up here. It's not quite there, is it? Eh, I don't really remember anything. Guy, I suck. Though I already figured as much. I sketched them out for you. Why didn't you just draw the runes themselves? How much blood? There's no- Bro, the mom is dead. You can't even get that much blood from one cut. You might have had a good reason for not drawing them yet. Fair, whatever. Give me the card. I'll get the money. I really don't like you, the I really don't like the idea of you wandering around all by yourself at this hour. It's already morning, though. Yeah, me. Just hand me the card. I actually can. I really leave Andrew alone with these two. Who knows what they'll say to him? He's wishy-washy enough as it is. Actually, 
I see. Okay, if I trust him, they're dead. Because every time I leave Andrew alone, he kills people. This is gonna go crazy. We're gonna save the game. I mean, we just saved right earlier, right? Uh, what would I do? Trust him is, like, good. Because... But, but, but it's bad for the relationship. But it's also good for the relationship. It's, like, bad. Um... Trust him. Leave him alone. Don't leave him alone. Leave the two alone. I really don't know. This is like a trick because it, it can backfire either way. I'm just gonna leave him alone, I guess. Ah, give me the card. I'll get the money. Yay! Be careful. Aren't I always? When are you ever? Haha, <laughs> I'm crazy. It'll be fine. He won't turn on me as long as I have the trinket. And now I can turn on her. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Hmm, the missing audio. But you can draw the missing runes. Where did Ashley get all this blood? Just take one look at your mom. G Is she making you do this, man? No. You gonna kill us? Come on, of course not. Andrew? T Dude, I don't... You're crazy. What is all this witchcraft-looking nonsense? Just let her scare you a little. We'll leave you alone after that. How about it? <sighs> Hard to say whether she believes you or not. Father doesn't have anything. I like the father, man. Just going along with your mother's whims. Exactly like you. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the ruins here. Uh, ru ru the ruins. Sorry. Okay. Dude, that's a lot of blood. There was something I tried to talk to you about earlier. Don't really care, actually. Ah, it's about Ashley. What is it? I wanted to apologize to you. For always making you look after her. That was wrong of me. Look where that got us. It's fine. Can you imagine what it was like for me back then? When I was your age, I was already stuck with a seven and a five-year-old to care for. Think you'd have fared better than me? I wouldn't know. This is an excuse, mind you. It's an explanation. I never hated you. <laughs> yeah, we kind of messed up, huh? Don't say that, honey, we did fine. <laughs> so fine, look where we are right now. We're being sacrificed to demons by our children. Anyway, you were such an easy child. I thought we'd just be fine having another. I think you were you were you were cursed by Lucifer. That's it. This is the this you were you were cursed, man. I wasn't counting on Ashley to be a literal demon. I'm sorry I made you raise her. I thought you were getting along. I didn't want to see what was happening. For that I apologize. It's my fault. I apologize. It is what it is, Mom. It does not have to be Andrew. We can still sort this out, man. Is that right? If it's money you need, I can help you get a job. They're hiring at your company, aren't they, love? That's right. If I put in a good word for you, you're as good as hired. They did try to kill us. If we trust them, they did try to kill us. This sucks. But they're probably... Better to trust than Ashley, but they did try to get rid of us, but maybe for a good reason. Be forewarned though, they get a lot of difficult customers there. I know you can handle it. Son, should be easy after handling that one all the time. What do you say, man? Really? Your parents are offering you an olive branch, save game. <laughs> hmm. I mean, look. Hmm. Except decline. They die. Well, they die anyway, probably, because Ashley's gonna... But she doesn't have the bullets! She can't kill anyone. Best ending, maybe. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, we're gonna accept. I like I like the dad. The mom seems a little more devious, but we, we do it for the dad, okay? I don't want to kill this guy. Whoa! Or maybe not? Andrew, brother... Literal brother, sigh. No, you- The illusion of choice, don't you dare. I wanna say yes. I, I, I wish I could say yes to that, honestly. Come on, man. But... I can't. I'm stuck. I'm stuck, you don't even know. You see the death certificates? <laughs> well, I noticed you had moved them. 
Must have been some ugly mix-up. We can clear that up. I don't know about that. Yeah, there's a lot more to it than that. Nothing has happened that can't be fixed yet, Andrew. And I'm not angry. I know you didn't want to do this. I mean, now this is like gaslighting from the mom, technically. Like, we can see the mom and Ashley are like one and the same. And the dad and Andrew are like one and the same. Convince Ashley to give us the- to give you the gun and we can put this behind us. Or just say the gun isn't even loaded, man. Holy crap. <laughs> I don't like that. Oh! Oh no. Andrew, man. Was it really a f Maybe it was a fake choice? Maybe the other choice was actually the right one? I need to light the candles. No, man. I don't wanna. I'm sorry, you two. You're messed up, but you're not as messed up as us. We're gonna be fine. Ashley needs to be okay. We're gonna be fine. Andrew? You'll get the gun from- Maybe there's another choice. Imagine three choices. Wow! I'm back! The ritual's ready. Can't even get a proper hello here. Can you just summon the damn thing? What's wrong? Everything. Just get to it, goddammit. Sheesh. No, I don't want I don't want to be in I can't control Ashley, but I can't control Andrew either, which sucks. Hi. Wait, the eye, what the hell? Are we doing this? Can we just go? Leave. Nope. The door's not even working. Okay, man. I mean, I I, I don't know. There's so many save points or save options. I mean, ahem. Hello? Mr. or Ms. Demon, hello. I, I don't have any mute music, but I got all the other stuff, I, you know? No answer. Maybe if I sing something. <laughs> Please don't, no, no, no. Oh, okay. The demon shows up to spare him for a second. Embarrassment. Okay, so the demon really is like just on our side, or our pal. Yeah, <laughs> the parents, the Tarso. What the hell is that? Jesus Christ. I offer those two, quick. Really? Dude, this game is too much. It's too fast. It doesn't... It's too fast. Demon steals their souls. Does that mean they're dead or are they just like empty husks? Well... I wonder if I should feel something. Anyway, the music wasn't needed for you? Why we have to play it last time then? The circle is hard to find. <laughs> Even the demon is a dumb bozo, man. Everyone's just a dummy here. That's insane. Sound is easy for me to follow. I'm just a little baby. Anyway, uh, you have my talisman, so it makes me easy to find. Speaking of which... A deal's a deal. One charge up, please. Yay. Thank you. Hmm. Uh, hello? Oh god, you never met the demon, huh? This is the brother. Yep, one and only. He may not be very useful or loyal or intelligent or anything, but... Uh, yeah, yeah, I don't know, actually. It's kind of dumb. I see. Farewell, Tar Soul. Until you have another. Right, thank you, bye bye. Oh, that was bad. I don't know why I keep you around either. Guess you're just stuck with me, aren't ya? Ah, stuck. <laughs> yeah, very stuck. Ah, an eavesdropper. Oh, you've misunderstood. I meant our situation. Uh oh. All the trust is gone. Yeah, sure. Ashley. Doesn't matter. Ashley, I picked you. I picked you. I don't want to talk. Come on, man. I don't care. I'm a snake. Eh, oddly spaced thoughts. What are we going to do about the bodies? Ashley, I... The bodies, Andy. Focus. Uh, 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 well, we didn't kill them. But their fingerprints are all over. And having them having gone missing would definitely be better for us. Doesn't the demon like just take their bodies too, man? That would make it easier. Maybe they just... <laughs> okay, who knows? Uh, but if there's a murder investigation... Yeah, let's make him disappear, huh? Stop. Stop. This is not normal. You don't need to chop them up. Yes. Why is Ashley the normal one here? We're going to make them vanish. Just... Just bury them. Leave them. Put them in... Under the bed. Jesus Christ. There's a drain right there. What? Andrew is untying the parents, but stop. What are you doing? Wait, what? What? Is that breathing? 
They lost their souls. Not all lost is not all hope is lost. His chest is moving ever so slightly. What? 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 Oh! Ah. You try various things. I knew it. That's what I, I knew it. You, you go back. I noticed. It said steals their souls, but doesn't like kill them or something. Nothing gets a response though. They're in like a coma. Their lungs draw in air. God, what is this? Maybe losing your soul just turns you into like a vegetable? Maybe we gotta put them to the other vegetables outside? That can't be. The cultist died. The warden too. Well, did you actually check? Well, now they're dead. I sure didn't. Just went to town and started shopping. Oh no, don't tell me he wasn't alive when we ate him. No, it definitely wasn't, because he was dead by that point for sure. <laughs> what is funny about this, you sicko? Come on, I'm sure he died from blood loss. If not, you're ripping this head up. That's why he talked to us. That's why he talked to us in the dream. <laughs> God damn it. Yep. It'll be the same with these two. Get to cutting. No, no, this changes everything, doesn't it? You want to leave them like this? They're not getting their souls back. Imagine the good ending. We defeat the demon. Everyone goes back to life. Everything is back to normal. If you want to leave them to starve, I'm all for it. Wouldn't it be poetic? I don't know. I need to think. Come on, man. Where are you going? Andrew, look here for a sec. What? <laughs> we, she crazy. We need to kill her. We need to kill her. Right, I'm playing as Ashley. God damn it, that makes it even worse. We need to kill her. We need to strangle her. We need to finish the job. What the hell are you doing? They're all dead. <laughs> now tell me again how I always make you do all the dirty work. I don't like this because this means she's not all bark. She's actually all bite as well. They're both psychos. They're both over the edge. What the hell? <laughs> well, yep. You did not miss that sigh of relief. Anyway, you drag him over to the shower. Are we really just going on, huh? I'll start cutting. Why are we doing a mini game for this? Stop, stop, stop. It's flooding, huh? Oh, what the? You are really the dumbest. <laughs> the grain's clogged. Yeah, we, we saw. Didn't we see that the grain was clogged? I need a screwdriver. You just keep chopping the pot. It's just. It's just absolutely messed up. It's here, yeah, remember. How do you unclog this? We can pour it down. Yeah, baking soda. Vin All right, right, wait. Yeah. Here, I think. Vinegar. And then I guess... In the kitchen. Top cabinets. Baking soda, okay, easy peasy. Of course, you never know, maybe something we can do here. Some secret, maybe some gloves though. That's probably what we're gonna need for like later. Here you go, man. Pour in some. Does it matter the order, I guess? I guess, what would I, what I, what I, what I do? Well, I mean, I guess it's not like we're just gonna, I don't even know it. That was vinegar, there we go. By bubbling up. Clog doesn't lessen. Oh, we tried. Oh, rubber gloves, yep. Of course, I'm but a dainty little lady. You can't expect me to do a man's job. Get me the gloves, goddammit, right here. Where's our blood gone? Look, the runes are gone. Here you go, have fun with that. Yep. Yeah. Digs out god knows what out of the drain. Never ending amount of god knows what. That's disgusting. I'm gonna gag. Yeah, this one is gonna make you gag. You're not helping. That's gross. Dude, can you stop? Andy doesn't respond. Good, good. He's finally coming around. Insane psycho. Insane psycho, but it's also worrisome. There's no like l not even happy never happy this one. Let's get this over with What are you doing? This is not normal. This is how is this better than burying them? How? How? The, how? You have all the time in the world. Maybe the neighbors would see how is in, in no world is this better? Can't you also, like, find this, maybe? Ease? Like, I don't... Okay. <laughs> You're amazing. We don't need to see that. Bro. What a psycho. What a psycho woman. Crazy. Having regrets? Yes. Would I be allowed to say so? Probably not. I don't want to see this, dude. You can tell me anything, bro. 
anything I want used against me anyway. I love you, Andy. I love you. God damn it. I'm sorry for lashing out earlier. I forgot how hard this is for you. I'm fine. No, you're not. Talk to me. <sighs> Boop. I've got nothing to say to you. Well, <laughs> imagine. I thought he took the cleaver and... <laughs> do it. Just right into Ashley's face, man. The good ending, but no. It's just the parents. You got no idea what he's thinking. Oh, so what's the plan here? We're to dispose of it all. Oh, I see, never mind. So, th so the drain was only for the blood. I thought they were like putting the head and everything down the drain. I was like, what the hell? Maybe down the toilet? Nah, man. We'll use whatever means available in the house. Let's look around. Torso times two. All the limbs, a lot of limbs. Got a head, a very weird, a very strange, extremely messed up. Just flush it down the toilet. Maybe not. Okay. I mean, here maybe? Put them in the washer, it could work. What are we doing? Like, what, what is happening? What are we doing exactly? Like, what the hell are we doing? Can anyone, like, tell me? I don't even know what exactly we're doing. And we need everything they said in the house. No? No. 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 This is not normal! These people, no human being can even do this. No normal human being could use- It's their parents! It's parents! What's wrong with you? Throw them in the fireplace! What about the skulls? Thank you. Good is gone. I'm I'm I I can't even talk anymore. I'm 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 just watching what's happening. This is absolutely unhinged. Can we burn the bodies? I mean, watch. Place the torso, huh? Nothing is happening. Just, we just gotta burn down the house or what? Give it a minute. Goddamn, this ain't working. Stop it. Thank you. Do we have to cook some? There's no way. Bro, this is crazy. Stop it. I don't- Stop it right here. Stop it. This is, stop it. Ashley, you demon. Stop it. You crazy. Andrew, you should not be okay with it. You stop it. You stop it. Right there, read it. Do we- From- Here- get, Nerd. Welcome- There's- I, No. There's no way we're doing this. Brother. This, this app. No, I actually want to just bury them here, right? Look, the perfect spot to bury them. You have lost your mind. You lost your absolute mind. You lost your mind. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what? Meat. Well, we have the meat. We want extra meat? Right, 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 right. right. Much better than your soup. Was there anything else we didn't need to steal with? I was there. I mean... <sighs> I think the soup is ready yet. Really? I guess we are done. <laughs> Why? Look, the first time it was okay, because it was like we had to do it, kinda? This is not normal. I'm eating too? Of course. This is the last hearty home-cooked meal for a while. You're really not gonna have any? Thank you, Andrew. I don't see the point, man. There's other food available. Don't you want to feel powerful? Bruh. Explain. Well, uh, um, yum, yum, yum. Uh, humans are at the top of the food chain, right? Uh, when I come and eat the humans, I'm on top of that. It's not how that works, but whatever. This is your diet now. Sacrifice people, you eat them. Eh, you're not getting it. Let me try explaining again. I don't need to get it, man. I just need to know if this is gonna be a thing now, like a wacky ongoing joke in this game. I'm the one who's gonna have to sort it out. It's like if I eat someone, I'm eating their entire life so far. Everything they've known and felt, I'm consuming all that. 
If I could turn them into some sort of energy, I'd be all powerful. Is this power leave? Well, I don't know, man. The demon. Super nutrients, huh? If you say so. You're not getting it at all, bro. Even if I could magically absorb someone else's life, what would I do with that? I got no desire at all to be our... To be our mother or father in any capacity. Yeah? That's... No? Stop. Bro, I can't handle these two. <laughs> I don't... Stop. No. No. Yeah, get the gun. God damn it. Nothing. Anyway. We've dealt with the flesh to the best of our abilities. We still need to do something about the bones. Well, I need to ditch the leftover soup. I'll clean the kitchen. Don't make me do it, man. Oh, it's oh, it's me. Check this into the trash bin, huh? How are you doing, bro? Don't worry too much about someone seeing you throw away the soup. She never looks nervous, man. Yeah. Ah, right, what was I thinking? You wouldn't worry, exactly. Crazy. I don't want to talk right now. Understandable. Although I'm still not happy with you for just not caring at all what the hell's happening, man. Alright, well, this house is just messed up. Mm -hmm. Andrew, what do you have to say to you for yourself? I, I gotta get the hell out of here, man. I'll just collect them all. Mm -hmm. I mean, this, these two? The bones mm -hmm. remain. Got the bones. The plastic bags. And I don't remember if there was anything. What are you doing down here? Oh, oh my god, what do we have these skulls? Don't show them, man. You're, you two are mental. You're insane. You're psychos. Throwing those into the ocean. So much for making them disappear. What do we do all these other crap for? Quiet, you. As long as the teeth are removed, it should be fine. Based on what logic? Uh, dental records? You get. Ah, oh, nice. Forgive me, O oh beloved, for I have never gotten rid of a body before. I'm hoping one can't identify someone based on their bones alone. Do bones float though? Aren't they kind of like sticks? Just bury them, but then the dog's gonna find them. I'll find something to weigh them down just in case. Mafia style, huh? Ugh. Dude, this is messed up. In insane. 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 We lose the teeth, bag the bones, call it a day. The rock! I'm sorry, the rock's finally gonna be used, I knew it! Oh. Okay. Wish you could do this all, your problems. My god, man. Yeah. Wait, what? The bones and the rocks? Okay, sure. Which is like, just like, this is like depressing, man. Just, we're just, we're doing this, man. No, nothing. Got some rocks. One of the plastic bags. Wait, but now? Actually, what I could do, I mean, I could say, I don't even know at this point. This is just messed up. Room, room. Skull, but toothless. Should throw these at Ashley, true. <laughs> okay, that was worth it. <laughs> that was worth it for the freaking text here. Finally, just cleaning up the basement now. Do we have to? Yeah, obviously. Why? We'll have to sacrifice someone here again later. Why would it have to be here? We're going to live here. Oh, uh, we just have to keep paying our rent, parents to rent or whatever. I wish we could, but someone's gonna go, Hey, Mrs. Graves hasn't showed up to work in a while. So they get fired or what? I doubt either of their bosses care enough to file a missing persons report, especially not in this messed up world. Also the fact they apparently mingled with the people here. The neighbors will notice them gone, despite their names still being on the door. We can tell some lie. We're house watching for our parents and so on. Listen, not everyone gives zero like you, man. God damn it, they have co-workers, friends, other family. Well, we're not really family at this point, I guess. Bro! Why weren't they happy with just each other's? I didn't- Oh my god, man, actually irrelevant. It's all the same to me. Anyway, they can't just go haven't- They can all go haven't heard from those two in a while, oh well. Someone's gonna come looking with the authorities. Who will they find here? Their children. With blood everywhere, the bones in the drain, everything, the teeth in the toilet. And we didn't report them missing. Officers, <laughs> how the hell are you dead? Well, if you don't want to stay here, just say so. It's not that I don't want to, I don't think we can. Can we at least use their IDs? We can be the new and improved Mr. and Mrs. Graves. And go to, and go to work and have a normal life. We'd run into the same problem as with our own IDs. 
Once the authorities start looking, they'll see what we've been up to with theirs. <sighs> Sorry, Ashley, I wish it was that easy. Whatever. I'll clean the basement. Okay. I don't like that we're even switching for no reason because it feels like something. Yeah. I really. Something's gonna mess up, man. I really thought we were in the clear after all this. Whatever. I need a map. I'll see it right here, man. An excellent map. Oh. We got sad music. Put it back. Get the candles. Maybe the room. Okay. I guess they turn white and not blood anymore when the ritual is done. Should I put the candles back too? Sure. Right there. Okay. We done, huh? Go to sleep. <laughs> sleep away all our problems. Find our bro. Hello. I'm so sad. All done. Ready to go? Think so. Though there's no way to tell if we missed something still. Other than maybe see if you have a dream where we're caught, I guess. True. I offer two souls, so two visions. How about I take a nap and see if a disaster awaits us? Please do. Okay, I mean, do we have to do it here? <laughs> really? What are the conditions to get a vision? As in, what did the demon say about it exactly? Hell if I remember. You don't? Uh, could you possibly give any less? Would well, that be great, man? Do forgive me, your highness. It's been a week or two. And up yours, you didn't even remember our parents' address. Which is, of course, just as important as this. Look, just said that I need to hold on to it to have clairvoyant dreams, that's it. It was in my pocket last time when it happened. Then could I hold it this time? Nope. Come on, man. Even if you'd have a vision, you just freak out, overthink it. Man, you can barely understand what's happening in the present, much less in the future. If anyone should be ciphering what these dreams are about, it should be me. Screw you, man. No, I'm definitely not letting you have it. Ah, fine, it was uncalled for. You're not getting my trinket. I'm the demon here. Fine, whatever, probably for the best. Have an awful night and terrible dreams. Amazing, thank you. <laughs> Go to sleep. This again, huh? Well, this looks familiar-ish. It's the demon summoning me again. It did say it would. I mean... Uh, gibberish, huh? Door is barricaded. Oh, we got, really? Okay, this one again. I remember, I remember. Good times, good times. Pick up the fl fl flowers. Someone is at the door. Maybe I shouldn't stay here. Are we getting a... Wait, actually, let me save. Imagine. Hello. Okay, we're stupid. Get out of here. Maybe it's like actually a time thing. Go, 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 go. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, man. Someone live nearby. Demons can teleport. And even firewood. Stop! You're being pursued! God damn it! Got an axe! Chop, chop, chop! Get chopping, man! Uh, do we have to kill? What do we do? Do we have to. Oh, right here! Bum, 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 bum! Road sign! Get that! Yeah, I got that! Boom, boom, boom! Nice! Okay, who's gonna chase us? Ah, right! Very, very smart! Chop, 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 chop! Kick, kick down the void! Ah, da, 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 da. I don't think the pursuer well like it. The lock. We need the black key, okay, I see. Okay, okay, I know I know how this works. Right there. Then I guess go up first. No? No? Or here. Okay. Okay, I got the wooden plank. I see I see. Why not put the ro I get I guess I could have just put the flowers here, though. It makes no sense. What's the difference? What? Ah. That's why we need the plank. Ah, crap. Okay. Okay, that's kind of cool, though. I like the tutorial. It tells you you have to get back the plank, like the road sign. And now it uses that as like a puzzle. That's kind of clever, I think. I like that. Okay. And then just here. And then... Boom. Okay. No! It's locked. Yeah. More flowers. Oh. Really? Never mind. What's that? The key! <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm so dumb. Thanks. Okay, here you go. My goodness gracious, man. Do we have to do this? Tiny tree gets... Oh, we're, ju we're just cutting. We're just axing. We're just crazy. Okay. Oh, no. Actually, I don't know. Do we- we have an axe? 
Choppy chop chop. Pew pew pew. <sighs> hmm. Are we doing this to get places or can we use the wood? I don't think so. I think we're just chopping like crazy. Can we go? I don't have a key. The white key. Aha, but we need. Ah, okay. Sure. Ah, oh, my head hurts with this, man. Uh, do I have to go all the way back? Was it a dead end? Nope. Hum. Okay, it's interesting because we don't have any uh, flowers. I believe. And there's no way to loop around unless... I mean, maybe the key works here, no? Am I just blind? Can I just go up? Oh! Ah, okay, fine. We can go here for some reason. Destroy all the trees, maybe achievement. Music's kind of cool. Okay. Got all the wood. Ooh, okay, we gotta run, maybe. Oh, it was you! <laughs> God damn it. But maybe you're, you're, you want to kill us. It's a monster. I don't suppose we could talk things out. Truce? Play nice with your sister, Andy. <sighs> really? <laughs> Tag, I'm it. You should run. In three, two, one. Holy crap, dude. Um, we can't run. It's not my fault. This episode is titled. Wait, 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 what? Is this real life? Andy and Laylee and... What? <laughs> Andrew, wait! The final finale, finally! Dude, Ashley not looking too hot right now. Wait, no, it's still the dream. Unless, are you with me in the dream? I'm sorry, okay? I'll be better. Let's leave and forget about all this. Everything we've been behave, I promise. You've shown me that's not true. I'm not falling for this again. No, wait, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Andrew, I'm sorry. I'm tired of your sorries. Oh! Oh, we're doing it! She's dead! In the dream! No! She's alive! <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, why? I forgot it's a vision! Yes, dude! What did I do to piss him off like that? Everything. <laughs> we're gonna have... Dude, we're gonna go... Dude, this is gonna mess things up, though, because now... She's gonna go crazy with that. She's gonna kill him, bro. That's gonna be the ending. One of them has to kill each other. Why would Andy ever? He wouldn't. Not my Andy. <gasps> yeah, exactly. I suppose he might. He already tried the first episode. Andrew might anyway. It's him less and less and less. <gasps> Everything okay with you? Oh, uh, guess I had a nightmare. A vision? No. Uh -uh. Ah, uh, no, it's just vague nonsense. Okay. Hey, Andy? Uh, please be Andy, please be Andy, please be Andy. Uh, what? Oh, God, okay, nothing. Uh, never mind. Wait. I love you, Andy. Thanks. Gee, oh, God damn it. Would it kill you to say it back to me every once in a while? Uh, you keep calling me by some other guy's name. What do you expect? Hmm. Come on. Our parents won't jump into the ocean by themselves. Uh, I want to go back to sleep. I shouldn't uh, just throw away. Is there anything like here? Where's the trinket? All oh, right, demon trinket. Uh, what? Oh, oh, you're behind me, huh? Okay. So, so we're just leaving. That's it. We're we're done. Nothing down here. We're we're good. To, we're good to go. We can actually get run over. Best ending. No. Okay. Say hello to the neighbors. No, we're leaving. I think we're going into the car. Never, we're never speaking of what a horror. What? Why? What? Why? Why? The bag ripped? Whoops! You're picking that up, bro. What? So who's gonna come in? Don't kill, it. bro. I wasn't the one to pack them in this flimsy bag. Pick him up, man. Why you just call me? Now, Ashley. All right, all right. Quick before someone comes, man. Thank you. But we're probably on camera. Thank God, no one's here at this hour. Unless, hello? Someone hiding in the bushes? Just go in and leave. Room, room. Don't stray too far into the light. 
In case someone puzz pass by. Just here, right here. There's a sign. Yeah, we're just checking on. This is littering, man. You shouldn't do that, though. This is the worst crime we've done so far. What about the skulls? They're no longer in the bag. Yes, chuck them, man. If you say so. Baseball. Zoom. Well, congratulations for your loss. Very clever. <laughs> what? Nothing. What we do now? Whatever you want. Well, is this new? How come? We'll end up doing whatever you want anyway. Why even ask me? <laughs> you mad at me? Nah. What do you want to do, Ashley? I want to do what you want to do. I'm gonna turn ourselves in then. <laughs> Not that, what the hell? So much for my opinion. Not that I was serious. Eh. You're totally mad at me, Andy. Why? Remember when you promised you wouldn't call me that anymore? It kind of makes our promises not mean anything, huh? Nope. But I remember half a minute ago when you said we'd do what I want. You're really gonna treat me this way? After all I've just done for you? You're mad at me. I knew it. I asked you for one thing, Ashley. Just one. Not a big thing, mind you. Not even a really difficult one. Yeah, I'm mad. But so what? Not as if you're gonna do anything about it. Just pick the next stupid thing you wanna do and let's go. You were fine with me calling you Andy back at the house yesterday. Ooh, it's because we listened to the mom and dad. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> we're fighting back. I had to be, didn't I? <sighs> you knew I couldn't afford to start a fight with you then. That's why you started pushing for it. I think I didn't pick up on that. Well, there's neither appearances to keep nor corpses to hide. <sighs> Do you want to have another go at it? Yeah, oddly spaced thoughts. Well, what would you want, Andrew? Oh, she's crying, man. Ah, <sighs> ah, <sighs> goddamn it! Want to lock you in the trunk of the car and drive off the bridge? <laughs> I'm crazy. You think I'm kidding? Uh, I don't want to be in the same grave as mom and dad. Spare me the respect, half the respect I give you. Right, I will. Right after you love me with half the heart I love you with. How exactly is irritating me supposed to inspire any tenderness? Eh, it's complicated. I'm a very complex person, you know, I'm like a demon. The hell you are, you simpleton. If I'm so simple, how come you can't keep up? I have to be stupid to understand the thoughts of the stupids. Do like the children again, little children, arrogant prick man, get over yourself. Eh, later. Meanwhile, get in the car, we're out of here. Oh, where are we going? Well, now you're happy again. To the bottom of the ocean, yeah. I just want to leave before the corpses float up or something. I wonder if we're fine now. Hmm. Oh, right, he's probably fine. Yep. End of episode two. We did it, man. Okay. Ashley's gonna get owned. Wait, no, they're not. Ah, that's kind of smart. You know what's gonna happen, though. End of episode two. Got an achievement for that. Yes, pass. We're gonna save the game, sure. I mean, yeah, this is like here, file 12. Hell yeah. DK has been updated. Bam. Okay. Okay. I mean, immediately, huh? Just leaves you with that. We don't even have a fun little drawing, which is sad. But I guess there's no fun anymore after this. Whoo, Jesus Christ, man. Don't even know what to say. I mean, what do I say? The freaking. You know what this means, because I was thinking like Ashley can't escape it, but no, of course we, we we prevented the first vision of happening, so you can prevent the vision. So I'm I'm guessing the most logical ending would be like there's one ending where you actually just die as Ashley. If you put if you if you somehow like aren't careful, Andy Andrew just kills Ashley. But there might be the only other way might be to kill Andrew. Like, that is kind of where it is going. I think that would be the most typical and, like, most logical, like, two endings, right? One of them has to die. Maybe both of them die. Probably an ending where none of them die. But it seems like that's gonna happen. But okay. That was a lot. <laughs> I don't know. Look. The first episode was like, you put into like a crazy situation, but you're just kind of like, okay, fine, we have to do it. There's no going back from this. There's, there's literally no going back from this. There's no, uh, there's no justification for any of it. You could maybe justify it by being like, like, made to do it by the demon. You know, if there's a literal demon telling you to do it. But I don't know. I, I don't know about that. I don't think that's gonna help you. The coffin of Andy and Lelia, huh? Full decay. 
for these two, and it's again, it's only gonna get worse probably next time. I don't even know if the cultists are still in the picture. I don't know if that's even like a plot point. Is it just these two? Is it just the demon? Crazy, man. He absolutely unhinged. I guess we do have to check the credits, though. It, yeah. Cool. Kit9 Studio Partners. Okay, lots of plugins. Got some cool background music and everything. Got some cool sound effects, too, which we heard a lot. And the font, of course. RPG Maker. Indeed. And that's it. Really cool too. I like. I always like simple credits, simple menu. That gets a thumbs up from me. But anyway, guys, <laughs> Coffin of Andy and Lele, P probably the most unhinged thing I've played. I don't even know. I'm. I've. Uh, look, I. I do feel like episode three. Uh, it. I don't even know if it can get worse because you can't do much worse than what they did to their parents. Because. Because that is like. Completely unprovoked, and that's the problem, man. These two, Andrew, don't even give me that look. You're fully, I'm sorry. I gave you the olive branch, they gave you the olive branch. I accepted it, you chose not to do it. I don't care if you're being manipulated. I got my eyes on both of you, man. You're both gonna go down to hell, and I think you both deserve it. Sorry, Andrew. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I hope you liked the video. Until next time, take care.